out there. Also, a friend of Party Zone Studio. Now, first of all, the usual stuff. How, how exactly <coughs> did you did you guys form? Yeah. As you mean, what happened? About six years before? ago. About six years ago. Yeah, we were. Um, yeah, we used to like do graffiti and stuff. We met through a mutual friend. We we're both DJs as well. Yeah. And then we just started doing mixes together. Like we just sort of carried on the DJing thing because it was something we were both interested in. Mm. And then it just sort of evolved from there. We got samples and drum machines in on it and we ended up taking other people's music out of our mixes. Yeah, completely. Became our own mixes, became tracks. Yeah. What about for people? For a lot of people, this this kind of music style, like, well, how exactly would you like to call it? Would you call it just the music. music intelligent? You know, I don't know what the right name for this, but what, what would say what's the difference between you and Ethics Twin or whoever is BJ? Anyone? What, what what's the difference? Just a different sound. That's all it is, literally. I mean, it's like. The only reason we get grouped with Apex Twin is because we do things that are original and we still do dance music. Mm. And it's like, unless you kind of garage or you, you know, unless it's easily definable, we kind of shove you in our bracket, which mm. is kind of original music. But I mean, we are like completely different. If you listen to our album and then you listen to like Ambient Works yeah. too, you'd be hard pushed to find anything that's the same. What do you think actually with this kind of stuff? Is it production wise, is it more complex than. than say writing a tune with a catchy hook or no, it's no more complex it's just it's just that there's there's a kind of stage that you go through where you're getting more ideas like with a garage track you tend to write to a formula mm. you know which is it's just as difficult it takes just as long to come up with the end result because you have to fine tune it so that it suits whatever it was whereas if you're doing music like ours it's about having ideas but it's quicker because you I don't think with our stuff as opposed to say like a garage tune you write to a formula and if it goes beyond that formula you cut whatever you don't need off yeah you, you keep it perfect traditional to garage with the sort of stuff we do you can go on forever doing what you want to do that's all we're doing everything if we want to do a, a garage in riff there you go completely mad then don't you just no, like chucking it sounds and get totally excited in the end so yeah. it's just <laughs> yeah. oh yeah oh yeah. yeah. hold on yeah. <laughs> it's gonna be too it mad depends. It, it depends it's full of good stuff it's, yeah. it's full of good stuff it all stays and you just make sure you can fit it all in yeah yeah if you can't you take the crap out you know yeah i mean it's just a, I mean, you get used to sort of filtering what's good and what isn't good out of your tracks you're kind of like obviously you have loads of ideas and you want to get everything down but after a bit you sort of think well that doesn't work pull it you know whatever mm. you kind of end up with i don't know something that you're happy with and then that's it so what about do you think there's any kind of sexuality in computers i mean is there has there is there like a in sexual computers. feel in computer music i mean is there it's yeah. very organic definitely I, mean, I, I believe it's organic I don't know about sexuality, but I know it's a cure for insomnia, our album, so... <laughs> yeah. You think so, it is? Yeah, I've been told it is, but... Isn't that like a bit of an insult? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know, we like, we're right. like sleeping. <laughs> <laughs> and um, another thing, what about, what about all these, all the names? It's like a lot of mad, complex names for songs. I mean, where did they all come from? And what, what? They're just in jokes. That's all they are. Plays I mean, all, yeah, all our titles are in jokes. Like, so, for instance, Metal. <laughs> metal. Yeah. yeah metal. I mean, that, that's spelled M A E T L, and people don't know how to say it, but it, it's my apple. Yeah, it's me apple. It's because it, well, it, it's mad. Comes from years ago, really. Because we start, we we, like, we went through ages of taking taking the Mickey out of like West Coast Americans who also do a lot, yeah. Yeah. Like, hey, dude, and it was kind of like it ended up being doodle for a bit. And then it, then it just got I love really them because they've got their own lingo, it's wicked. Yeah, okay. it just, and then it, it just it went to Scottish up. and then uh, Australian. So it's like a, <laughs> a West Coast Australian Scottish accent for friend. Yeah. That is fine. Anyway, listen, let's move from Autocar in just a minute. First up, um, a bit of the warp motion, no, the warp um, long form video motion. That's it. Here it is. <laughs> 